Okay, how many times have you looked at someone's artwork and said, I wish I could do that? Mm -hmm. I say that all the time. Well, our Sherry Belafonte found a man who says anyone can be a master of the arts. In fact, he's taught thousands of people exactly how to 4, paint. And Sherry is one of those example, people today. To Hi, Sherry. Catherine, 4,000 to be exact a week are attending classes here. Larry Gluck, who's the head here of Mission Renaissance Art School, is going to teach me, are you ready? Teach me yes. how to draw. I drew a little thing at the top of the show, and I'm actually not so good at this, but you know what? Let's show a little t piece of tape just so you can have an example of somebody who started right at the beginning. I think we're going to see their first lesson. Um, and this, after 50 lessons, is what this woman did. You have, t you have students. This is Larry Gluck, everybody, who runs the, the Mission Renaissance. Right. You have students that are 5 to 85 years old. Right. And they have one lesson. In one lesson, you can teach them what? Well, we teach people who are, let's say, uh, 16 or 17 up in one lesson how to sketch. How to sketch. Yes. And you have students, you said they're, they start five years old and they're 85 yeah, years old. Yeah, that's right. The children's program is different than the adult program, mm -hmm. but they all learn how to draw and then paint. And that's basically what everybody has to do first anyway, right? Yeah, Not just paint and then draw. You have to learn how to draw in order to really be able to paint. Yeah, see, I started painting right away. I got right into the finger paints and did all that stuff, but right. now I'm going, you're going to teach me how to draw, right? Absolutely. I'm going to sit here. This is, <laughs> this is the first thing that I did. I don't know if you can sort of see that, but we're getting rid of that. Because right. I understand I was holding the pencil totally wrong, so. Good. Um, you have 16 locations here in California right. and in Canada. Right. We are right now, where are we? Glendale. We're in Glendale right now. This is, this is the way I was holding the pencil before. Clearly, this is not the way to do this. <laughs> okay, look. The word draw means to pull. Okay. You pull to draw. Okay. What you've been doing is pushing. Go, uh, draw the way you were just drawing. So I was before. drawing like this. Yeah, you were pushing. Yeah. So instead, we're going to teach you how to pull. Sherry, pull does it. he believe he can teach anybody to do what he's going to teach you right here? He thinks he's going to teach me how to, <laughs> how to pull in like a minute or less. Now, I guess we're going to have 20 minutes here between now and when we come back. But he's going to teach me how to pull instead of draw. Which ask is ask what Larry I if no, anybody could learn. how to pull to draw. Can anybody learn how to do this? Anybody can learn how to do this, yes. <laughs> And Sherry, Sherry, I was reading that 75% of the people who actually go there are women. That's right. You said it was about 75 people. Yes, 75 that's right. 75% of the people who come here. He does have men and women. Uh, we were talking about the fact that most of the men, I guess, take classes after work. Uh-huh. Um, but he's got students, young students, kids. Right. And uh, now he's got the 45-year-old lady here who's going to learn well, how to pull. We are going to check back with you a little later and find out exactly what kind of talent you have on the drawing board there. Or whether or not I should just stick with the camera. I think maybe, maybe shooting no, pictures no, is no. Loosen, loosen up, Sherry, and learn to pull your pencil That's across exactly the page. exactly what I told her we're going to do. It. Loosen Good. Up. All right. You loosen up. We will check back with you and see what Larry can teach Sherry to do in 15 or 20 minutes. It'll probably be glorious. Of course. Yeah. Thanks, Sherry. Well, as you know, we shent, sent Sherry Belafonte to the uh, Mission Renaissance Fine Arts Studio in Glendale to learn how to draw and become an expert. And actually, this was started for kids because a lot of schools do not have fine art programs, so this was started to teach them the fundamentals. But of course, all the adults have taken it now, too. Lots of women turn to art after their kids are launched into school for a little therapy, a little mm -hmm. fun, find out they can make a career out of it. Miss Sherry, are you able to make a career out of art, my you dear? You know what? I'm giving up everything else and I'm just going to become a famous artist. That's all there is to it. This is so much fun. I have to tell you the difference between what I used to do, which is very sort of stoic and staid, this is so much more freer and forgiving. I mean, look at this. Doesn't that actually look? Maybe we can get Ooh, a little that's shot fabulous. of it. Yeah. It actually looks like a bottle and an apple and a, and a bowl, which it, is right over there. But It's better than your first one. It's definitely better than my first one. Yeah. <laughs> but, Are you uh, surprised? You know, anybody who's interested in taking art classes, 1-800-430-ART. Four right, 4304 oh, Art for any of the classes. There's 16 studios between, there's I think four or five up in Canada, and then the rest of them are down here in southern Los Angeles and all through California. And you will have the best time. This is so relaxing, it's so much fun, and uh, I'm, I'm doing this for like life. You ready? Well, Look at this. Career. Sherry, I, I, I heard <laughs> that a lot of people who take these classes end up leaving their careers and becoming art professionals. Yes, and we so know that my career back, right, though, right? Yeah, well, I was going to say, my career right now is what? Shopping for the girls, right. I think, right? So now instead of shopping for you guys and losing all my money, I'll just make pictures for you and bring them in. Larry? Yes? Is there anybody who should not 
ever take up art no. as a relaxation and a, a therapy. Absolutely not. That, the idea that people can't do this is a fallacy. Even if you can't draw a round circle unaided? <laughs> I'm telling you, and trust me when I tell you, and I am telling you this. I'm telling you this four or five times <laughs> before I actually tell you. Anybody can do this. Well, and yeah, you will have a great time doing it, Look too. how much your hand has loosened up. Look You're at this. free. Of course, I'll be definitely washing my hands at the end of the day, too. Look at this. It's very yeah. messy. Fabulous, it, Sherry. It looks like a lot of fun, and thank you for the tip. This is, uh, these Renaissance art classes have been around in mm -hmm. uh, California for years, and as you said, they started as taking the place of, of art classes that our schools were not providing, and now there they are. They're teaching children. They're teaching a lot of women, and uh, something we thought you ought to know about here in town. So we thank Larry. And uh, Sherry. And Sherry. A lot yeah. of folks, including Sherry, finding Thanks. their uh, more creative side these days. <laughs> their Van Gogh side. Yeah, There's the phone right. number right there on the screen. 1-800-430-4ART. <laughs>